What's good YouTube? Welcome back to another video over here on the Steps Ahead channel. Hopefully you're having a safe and productive day today. On today's video, we're gonna be looking over the brand Hyperdenim. Now this brand specializes in denim only, so we decided to pick up three pair of denim today that we're gonna look over and hopefully help to clear up any issues or concerns that you might have with the brand. So if you're new to my channel, go ahead and press that like and subscribe button because over here on the Steps Ahead channel, we drop weekly content from either brand reviews similar to this or my sneaker reviews or my travel vlogs. Either way, I don't want you guys to miss out on any of the good content that we drop each and every week. And to my Steps Ahead gang, welcome back. You guys already know we continue to go strong each and every week. And now let's go ahead and get into this video. So the three pair of pants that we picked up from Hyperdenim are actually three different variations of the camo cargos. Now I don't know about you guys, but I feel like having a good pair of camos in your actual wardrobe definitely helps for you know that versatility piece when you just want to throw something on real quick and not have to worry about it matching with a lot of things. You can't never go wrong with camo. So this first pair that I picked up was the Woodlawn camo. Now this right here would made me go back to get the other two pairs just because they definitely deliver with this pair. Now this is actually the um, cargo camos. Like I said before, you have those good pockets on the front. Definitely a lot of space so you can, you know, put some things in there if need be. And this gives you more of a tapered look and it has that kind of distressed knee on the bottom right there as you guys can see. And it gives a you know tapered look at the bottom. So this is the look that I was going for. I wanted the cargo type of look, but I didn't want them to be too wide, you know, but at the same time, I wanted to be able to breathe in them at the same time. So these definitely don't give you that super skinny type of, you know, biker type of vibes, but it's definitely a, you know, a nice good, good fit on them. I can't complain. And like I said, these made me go back and get those other pairs. So you got your good hyper denim. Um, what's this stitch in right here? This is pretty much the logo. It says Hyper Denim Los Angeles. This is a slim fit size 32. Then you have like your, what's this, hyperdenim.com. This pretty much just tells your directions on how to wash the jeans. And that's pretty much it. So, you know, you got your good, you got some pockets. Also, too, you got your pockets on the back. The pockets on the back are pretty deep, too, so you don't have to worry about something falling out. And these are just overall clean camo, you know, simple camo. These are the Woodline camos. Retail price on these was $60, so I feel like that's not bad, especially with them being based out of Los Angeles. They could have easily charged $100 for these just because of where they're at, but, you know, they're trying to work with everybody, so I feel like that's not bad. You got your good, uh, what's this? Your actual sizing. Well, this is the um, branding tag, hang tag, or whatever you want to call it. It just says, you know, $60 the price and all that good stuff. So, this is the first pair of camos. Like I said, solid pair, just the original pair. You can't go wrong with these. You guys let me know down in the comment box. So let's go ahead and get to this next pair. And this one we're gonna actually unwrap so you guys get the full presentation of what Hyperdenim actually brings to the table. All right, so now we have the actual packaging. Now they did put both pair of pants in the same packaging. Shout out to them because I did actually place two separate orders for these pair of pants and they were able to refund me. So I felt like that's something good. They could easily be like, no, you already placed the order or whatever the case may be, but they was willing to work with me. So shout out to them for the customer service. That definitely was good. So we'll get the packages open. Whatever one we look at first, that's the one we'll review. So. All right, so the first pair we're gonna look at is the Oliver pair. This is the Oliver camo. Now, this is your hyper denim bag that it comes in. So it does come double bag. This is the first bag and this is the second one. It comes in a double bag. And so this is your hyper denim. This has your hyper denim logo on there just to, you know, protect the jeans. So good packaging on that. Doesn't feel cheap. You just slide them on out. So these are, like I said before, the Oliver camo with those big pockets, like I said, on the front that I'm definitely gonna enjoy. You guys let me know. You feeling this pair over the over the original camos or do you like this Oliver color? So, I mean, they're definitely different. If you put them side by side, you guys let me know. You know what I'm saying? So, you can definitely tell the difference from, you know what I'm saying? My first thoughts on these, I'm definitely, I already knew I was gonna like them just because they give that same vibe, but just a different camo. So, you guys let me know. Size 32, like I said, these are slim fit but they don't fit like true skinny, so that's a good thing you're still able to breathe in them. Like I said on the last one, you got your sizing tag, well not your hang tag or whatever the case. This look like a wax string, kinda, kinda feels like a wax string, but might not be, but that's your little tagging right there. This is the back side. Like I said, with those deep pockets on the back, definitely can't go wrong with that. And you guys let me know, are you feeling this pair more than the actual Original camos, like I said, these are the Oliver color. Same exact jean, just with pants. These are considered pants, so they 
They have these in the actual pants section on the site. So if you go in there, make sure you click on the pants section and these will pop up. But these are the second pair of jeans that I was able to pick up. Another clean colorway, if you ask me, easy to put together. And I'm glad, you know, my second purchase, they didn't let me down. I already knew that, but you guys let me know. Now, all these were $60, so I feel like $60 is not bad for a solid pair of camos, but you guys let me know. Is that too much? I know some people might be like, ah, that's too much. I could have spent something a little cheaper. I don't know, but let me know. So let's go ahead and get over to this black pair now. Last pair of the review. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. They definitely are not letting me down. Same packaging as always. Like I said, hyper denim. You know, got it sealed up top. Good packaging. You can't go wrong. I mean, you guys didn't come in and see no packaging, but some people want to know exactly, you know, what they're getting for that $60 plus shipping. So I'm going to show you guys everything. So take them on out. You guys already know packaging. These are the all black ones right here. These are the black camos. You know I had to get a pair of black ones. You know what I'm saying? These are definitely, definitely clean right here. Can't go wrong with all black, but it's still, you know, you get that breakup of the camo in the background. These are clean, man. Definitely glad I picked these up. So we on the third pair now. If you haven't already, let me know your favorite pair that you've seen so far. Are you feeling the camos? Do you feel like $60 is kind of overpriced for these or you feel like that's a good price. I mean, my honest opinion, I feel like that's a solid price just because the actual stitching is good on here. It's not cheap. And they actually took that extra little step. Look, they even covered up the little, um, your actual button, you know what I'm saying? So it don't get scratched up before you get it. Little details like that, let them know, you know, let you know that they actually taking that extra step to make sure when you get it, it's fresh as can be, you know? So I ain't mad at you guys, Hyper Denim. I am not mad at you got that good old Hyper Denim logo in the back. Like I said, all my pants are 32. Um, yeah, these are 32. Like I said, slim fit. I'm 6'1", around 160. So these will definitely fit me well. I don't have to worry about the length. I actually feel like I have a little bit more length and that's always good. So, you know, when you sit down for the taller guys, you don't have automatic high waters, you know what I'm saying? These actually fit you right, you know what I'm saying? That's what I feel like. If you can't sit down and your jeans come up it might be a little too short unless you actually going for that actual look but you guys let me know so that's the last pair of camos that we have for you guys today and let me know down in the comment box man where you feeling these camos or you're not a big fan of the camos or you're kind of in the market to get yourself a more updated pair because you have some in your collection but it's older and it's time to get a new pair either way let me know down in the comment box what you guys think about from my pickups from hyper denim my honest opinion, I'm super excited about the pickups. I know I'll have these pair in my collection for long periods of time, so I'm not mad at all. So I appreciate you guys tuning in again to another video over here on the Steps Ahead channel. Steps Ahead gang, I appreciate you guys for continuing to push my videos out there and support the channel. And to all my new subscribers, if you haven't already, Make sure you go ahead and press that like and subscribe button and go ahead and join the Steps Ahead gang because we continue to go each and every week. And like I said earlier, I don't want you guys to miss out on any of this good content. Steps Ahead gang, stay positive, stay motivated, and of all things, stay blessed. Peace.